Hi guys, it's Monica. So when, now those of you that follow me know this, right? When I went to uh, the convention in Las Vegas and then Jay and I, my husband and I went to Hawaii for sort of like this impromptu four day trip. I had packed, um, I think it was two, two toppers and a wig because I'm a topper wearer. I wear a lot of toppers. My hair is thin. I just really feel more comfortable if I have a topper on. It gives me a little bit of fullness. It just makes me feel really much better. Anyways, I had started on my birthday, which was February 14th of this year. I had started a prescription pill and um, it's the pill version of say Rogaine. You have, it is prescription. It is extremely affordable. It's much, much more affordable than buying the drops that I was putting in my hair. So I had read about it. I had heard about it. And I said, hmm, you know, the Rogaine works good for me, but I'm not an everyday wash your hair person. So for me to be very consistent with putting the drops on my hair, especially if it's like my second or third day hair type of thing, it just never really worked out. It could never stay consistent. But when I was consistent, I noticed a bit of a difference in my hair. So I, I talked to the doctor and, um, I was going for my regular exam. I didn't go in just for that. So I talked to him about what I had been hearing about this medication. And he looked at it, he looked it up, and he said, you know, there's some good reports that it does help diminish hair shedding, hair loss, stimulate, you know, um, hair growth, uh, regrowth type of a thing. So, um, he prescribed it and I will mention it below, but it is again, a prescription. I think it cost me like five bucks for a month for this. And so I've been taking this tablet every day at bedtime since Valentine's day, my birthday. And I'll tell you, I have noticed a huge difference. I'm, I, and we're all different guys, right? So I don't want those of you that are suffering with, you know, hair loss to, to run think this is going to be a miracle cure because I don't know. But I personally have noticed a huge difference since I've been taking this prescription medicine. I mean, could there be side effects long term? Who knows, right? You know, who knows? But for now, for this point in my life, this has made a huge difference on my hair shedding and I feel also I'm starting to see some regrowth or fill in. However, I still have very thin hair. And when I went to Hawaii the end of March, I'd only been on this about six weeks at that point in time. Even though I was starting to see a difference, I didn't feel comfortable enough that I could go to convention without my toppers um, or, or anything. And I always wear, I'm always a person that, even when I wear a topper, I wear some sort of fiber, you know, some sort of a fill powder um, on my hair because... You know, when I wear a topper, I will wear a topper further back on my head, not usually in the front, even though my high forehead is what drives me batty, the worst, right? So I normally will take any kind of a fiber. I've got many different ones that I've used over the course of time. I'm always trying new ones. I'm looking to see what's going to, you know, st help fill in, give that appearance of fuller, thicker hair, not rub off, not run off, not not look weird you know sometimes you can put a fill-in powder and it's like you notice it right away now you you can see it right away it's, it sometimes looks really awful so i've tried all different kinds topics you name it i i in fact i have a full bottle of topics the exfusion right this is the one that i probably would have gone through in general very pricey i like this one i have the medium brown yeah, I have the medium brown shade, which is the shade that I would normally do, even though it looks really dark. So I've used that. I've used all sorts of different other ones, some that have been sent to me complimentary. Well, when I saw this, and this was sent to me complimentary as well, this is by a company called U-Star. And I kind of, I like the price point. I thought the price point was pretty reasonable. They have like all these packages. They're always having sales. And I figured I would try it. Now, I ended up getting Fiber Hole Spray. I ended up getting the, I think it's the Light Brown. 
shade. I have glasses on. I probably would get this in a medium brown for me. The light brown is a little bit lighter than the roots that I want to have. Now I know that's kind of weird. So if I was just worried about filling in the blonde part of my hair, this would be an absolutely perfect color, but I want my roots to be darker. So I will get this again and I will order the darker one. Now this has the little pump that, oh, I just did it, that you screw in. So I, yes, you can shake, you can put the shaker top on, it comes with that. Um, you can certainly do it that way. I love this. You screw this in, and I don't want to open it up because I have the, the top is off, right? Normally you'd have a shaker top that goes on there, and you could just shake this on your hair. And when you do that, it tends to go all over the place, right? It tends to fly around, it tends to go down in your face. Well, with this applicator, and all you do is you screw it on, you take the shaker part off, and you screw this on nice and tight, and you press it down. And you press it down, and it comes out like right where you want it to cover. Not all over the place, doesn't make a mess, doesn't come down your forehead and all that. I really like this. I like this applicator and, yeah, you know, a little cheat here. This actually fits on almost any of the containers. So when I travel to Hawaii and, and Vegas, I brought this. I brought the spray and I brought this cool little thing here. I said, well, maybe this is a way to keep it off your scalp, off your face. And, uh, and I wasn't really too sure how it would work, but that's exactly it. You can put it in, you can sprinkle if you're going to do the sprinkle, right? And it'll stay and kind of go into the area you want. If you're using the pump, I have, a need, I have not needed this. So anyways, long story short, U-Star, they have, I think, great prices. This came to with me to Vegas. I also took the spray. I love both these products. I, I love the pump. I love the fact that I can apply this right on the spot that I need, right on my part, right on the side, without it going all over the place. I think that's really cool. And then I love the spray. The spray is really nice. I think the packages, the pricing, it's so much more affordable than some of the others and some of, you know, like topics and all that. So I just wanted to share that with you. That was sent to me complimentary. I will have a code below if you use my link. Um, I probably earn a, you know, um, I don't know, something. But in either case, it's up to you whether you want to try something like this. If you've never tried a fill-in powder and you have thinning hair, it can make a huge difference on just how you feel about your hair. So I can't believe I'm just like really going on and on about this, but I use fill-in powders all the time. So this is just not me trying something I don't use. I use it all the time. And like I said, I used it in Vegas, went to Hawaii, yes, Jay was sick. I never once wore any of the toppers I brought in any of my, or the wig. I never once. I just did my bio hair the whole time. This is my bio hair. Um, I swear to gosh, the, that pill since February, my fallout has greatly diminished, greatly diminished. And I feel that I'm getting some growth. But visually, if you say, Monica, your hair looks really thin or thick, I should say, I really think a good fill powder gives you that illusion. So if I were to wash my hair right now and it's not styled, you would see how thin it was. And I think it makes a huge difference. So that's really cool. The other thing that I got, and I'll link all the information as well below, and I know many of you have heard of Dossier. Um, they, they make, um, I'm going to say knockoff perfumes. Well, they have perfumes that are not necessarily knockoff, but inspired by I'll link all this information. They reached out to me and they said, it's been a while. Do you want to try some of our perfumes again? I went, sure, right? So I wanted to see if I could get, this happens to be the Lancome. I cannot pronounce this. You can see I've got quite a bit here. The reason I have quite a bit here is this is actually my mom's bottle. And I have no idea what she did with the cover. But... My mom wore this perfume all the time. I wore this perfume all the time. I love, love the smell of this perfume. So when Darcia reached out to me, I said, I wonder if I can get 
something inspired by this 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 scent because I love it. And uh, I found it. And so they said, this is inspired by Lancome, La Viesta, whatever. I can never pronounce them. And they call it Gourmand Orange Blossom. Fraction of the price. I mean, fraction of the price. I've worn this, I don't know, a number of times. And I wear this. I have my own bottle of this. This just happens to be my mother's because it's the bigger one. I have the little tiny one. And nobody's ever picked up a difference at all. I can't tell the difference. So I'm like super happy because if you love this perfume, you will love this perfume. It's identical. It smells identical. Really identical. Gourmet Orange Blossom. Inspired by Lancome. Really, really love it. They So they said pick two. So I picked this one. And then I picked this other one. This is a Witty Sage. And... I don't know, um, I don't know the original, so I cannot tell you whether or not it's close to the original or the, not the original, but the perfume was inspired by. It's inspired, this one is inspired by Joe Malone, Wood Sage, Wood Sage, and Sea Salt. This is called Woody Sage. So whether or not this is close to the, the perfume it was inspired by. I have no idea, but I love this. I think, I'm so glad I picked this one because what attracted me was the name, Sage and Sea Salt, right? That was like, okay, beachy feeling and all that. So I got this and I thought that was nice. So sent to me complimentary from Dossier. I'll leave all the information below. Mother's Day is coming and um, Mother's Day is coming. So what better time, right, than to think about maybe a high-end perfume, perfume scent, smell, at a very, very affordable price. I really, really love it. And, you know, the, uh, the fill-in powder has been awesome. So next, in my next video, I'm going to talk about uh, a red light therapy that I've been doing. How long have I been doing it? Um, what are my thoughts on it? You know, I know you guys all, you know, you see, I think it's Omni Lux. I know many uh, influencers talk about that. Well, this is a different company. I love the story about this company. And I love the fact that when they reached out to me, they had been, a lot of times you get people that'll reach out to you. We love your videos, but they probably don't even really watch them. But when this company reached out to me, they actually talked about my videos and some of the stuff I talked about in my videos and things that I shared, which made me feel like, wow, somebody actually watched it. And then before they even agreed to send me the product, because they reached out to me, but they still wanted to make sure, they said, can we have a Zoom call? I'm like, oh, really? So I had, I had a Zoom meeting with one of the owners of the company who talked to me about their red light mask. I had that point in time when they reached out to me, had not heard of this company or this particular brand. So Candy Way, I'm telling you guys, I was shocked. I was shocked, A, number one, at how personal the service was, how they made me feel like they actually watched my videos and they actually wanted me to try this. They actually cared what my thoughts are and they actually cared enough to schedule a Zoom session with one of the owners so we could talk and I could ask questions, etc. So I can't tell you how impressed I am. So I'm going to talk about this in an upcoming video, but yeah, it's, it's amazing. So that's it for this video. I've got some wig reviews. I've got, I've got a topper. I got a topper sent to me that the fibers are awesome. The color is not right for me, but the fibers are like awesome. I can't wait to share that with you guys. So lots of stuff happening. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll catch you in my next video.